I know you're a fan from the moment you click this video, so let's get into it. Netflix original series Money Heist, also known as La Casa de Papel in its native Spanish, is a television heist crime drama series. Anyone familiar with Italian history knows the protest folk song Bella Ciao or Goodbye Beautiful. It was initially used by paddy field workers to protest in the 19th century and was rewritten for the Italian resistance protesting Nazi Germans during World War II. The song has staying power, used as a hymn to protest fascism, promoting the resistance. The professor in Berlin's father was a strong believer in the Italian resistance as his father fought in it, as the backstory for Bella Ciao's use in Money Heist goes. The song has had a resurgence since the Spanish Netflix show's first season, as a variety of versions of the protest song has appeared throughout the show's four parts. But using Bella Ciao in Money Heist is far from a coincidence. The world we live in now is full of protests and people fighting against the forces of fascism. These are some scenes where Bella Ciao represented the show. Berlin and the professor singing before the heist. Cut in between the police finding their home at the end of part one, the first major instance we see of Bella Ciao is the two half-brothers singing together before their heist. Considering the heist is in tribute to their deceased father who stole to try and live a good life for his children, they fight to defend their father's image. Moscow discovers dirt. A big symbol of Bella Chow is freedom, and the minute Moscow digs far enough in the vault to find dirt, they know freedom is close. Conveniently, the song also comes on the radio at the same time, and he and Denver sing, like the rest of the group, comes together to celebrate once they hear the commotion. As the cops discover the robbers got away, Right as it looks like the gang is too close to get away from the cops before they get to the hangar, it turns out they made it in the nick of time. Like the professor tells Raquel, they're not doing anything that the banks don't do. So why are they treated as terrorists when the bank is allowed to do it? Their freedom is well deserved. Here's a bonus clip from the series. So how can we use the song Bella Ciao now? As people sit in quarantine trying to find some sense of peace, a German neighborhood sang Bella Ciao from their roofs and balconies, trying to bring some hope and unity to their Italian neighbors struggling through the quarantine. Italians have been doing the same, trying to remind each other that this is the best way to resist the virus and save each other. How about you? How can you use the song Bella Ciao or Goodbye Beautiful in your life now? Comment down below! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching!